the availability of consumer electronics, so cheap consumer electronics connecting into your smartphone, allows you to pretty much enhance any sense around the body, whether that be, in my case, my eyes, or it might be hearing for somebody, or touch to replace that, or of course, you know, movement in terms of somebody in a wheelchair. So technology is allowing us to wrap services around people. And then, of course, because of smartphones and connectivity, to connect those people into a smarter society, into the digital healthcare system, which allows the information flow to get to every part of the d digital health environment. And I think the most important challenge is to make sure that all professionals involved at whatever stage, whether it be nursing, doctor, physicians, doctors, or indeed the care community, or family as well, are aware of the technology that we can use to change people's lives. Because there is so much technology available today, a lot of it has to be easily used, and the accessibility for people with different disabilities has to be developed to the extent where everyone can get access to it. I think from the point of view of caring for people after they come out of the the, the hospital environment in terms of remote monitoring, uh, remote diagnostics, remote consultation with the medical professionals and that smarter home environment that for example for me will allow me to change the temperature in the room you know, without having to be able to see the thermostat or to be able to do find things in the house without being able to see. Of course we're spending a lot of money, it will change within the hospitals themselves but we understand that. I think most importantly in the home environment and when people are cared for outside of the, the formal medical environment. Technology change is relatively easy and especially because it's now relatively cheap and commoditized technology that we're leveraging. The cultural change obviously requires much more because as we've known for, for generation after generation that if you try and introduce new technology it tends to be the younger people who adopt it very quickly. So the cultural change whether it be around doctor's practices uh, but certainly around the financial payment, the reward within the healthcare system. So cultural and financial are the two absolutely critical components. The importance of attending events such as Mobile World Congress, I think for the, for the healthcare specialists and people involved in it at whatever level, is to suddenly get some notion of what's possible from a, from a technology point of view and then how you can then apply it to your particular industry. I mean, healthcare gets a lot of attention from some of the big players exhibiting here this week because it's such a complex environment, we can simplify and streamline lots of processes through the technology. So every industry is impacted by this combination of better connected, the wearables, the internet of things. So it's important for professionals in any sector, but of course the healthcare is very close to many people's hearts, it's important for any professional to make sure they're aware of the possibilities, how they can apply that technology to really improve for everybody. Thank you.